still a very good morning. Are you still feeling good? We can help you feel better. Yeah. At what on Facebook, Y254 channel on Twitter. Hashtag is Y in the morning. Told you, Lydia's breakfast show in this here town. And if you don't believe me, don't take my word. Don't even. Just Monday, what wapa. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, all the way to social Friday. You won't regret it. You trust. Trust. Minito Val or at Color Me Val on everything. It is my honor to take you through the day. Now you know what time it is. It's time for strength of a woman. And we have I've just been salivating over her hair. Jesu. Woo! Guys, uh, woo! Uh, okay. But before we get any further, she is phenomenal in her own right. And I want you to meet her. And I want you to know a little bit about what she does. Good morning. Good morning. Sue is having nice hairs. Thank mm. you. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Thank you. Thank you. I tell them who you are. So I'm um, Joyce Mikali mm -hmm. from Nkuru Slums mm -hmm. in Nairobi South. Yeah. I'm, um, I, I do many things. I, like, I'm glad you said that. What's a start to zoom? Yeah. Uh -huh. I'm a hairdresser, Ooh. a mentor, a mm -hmm. facilitator, a skills trainer. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Tu wanza na hairdresser. Ukona salon yako? Sina salon. Mm. For now. Mm -hmm. But I'm working towards uh, owning my own one. If I wanted to, my hair to be done by you, how would I reach out? I'm, a, I'm mobile. Oh! <laughs> my I'm favorite mobile. kind. You come to me. <laughs> yes. I like... Ooh. So you can call me anytime and I'll be there. Situ chukwe number? Yeah. Tuchukwe, tukwe mm. number. Tuta chukwe badai after show. Sa. Yeah. <laughs> Sa. <laughs> All right. So you also said you are a facilitator. Yes. What does that mean? So um, I, I do work with uh, different organizations. Eh? Ku, kuna some program, programs zenye huwa tunafanya. Za, tuseme for example, kama kuna program inaitwa Families Matter huwa na facilitate. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I'm a peer educator too. Mm -hmm. yeah. What do you teach the youth? It's all about skills, mm -hmm. uh, life skills. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Kabla to 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 zoom sasa to journey skills gani sana sana and maybe find out your target audience. Mm -hmm. I want to tell you about a story in Ms. Mm -hmm. Something about a student somewhere in Kisi mm -hmm. school. Yeah. I hope. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wait, guys. Where is it? Guys, no, I want to get this right. It was a very, very, very just, I don't know, and I'm not going to find it, am I? But anyway, guys, basic thing is something happened at the PC school, so he apparently he was late for class, no, some evening classes. Alafuvizuri akaulizwa mbono mechelewa, alafu wakambiwa pige mago, apige magoti. Sasa hafta kuambiwa hivu wakaja, akaja. Sasa venya hafta meja, ndiyo hi, ya, mhm. Hafta meja, sasa ati he, he, he drew a knife from his socks and stabbed him repeatedly i think so i think ali mama sijui hip sijui wapi na wapi alafu mali mama mwenye alikuwa hapo alikuwa anajaribu kumsaidia and now the, the meat of the story iko hapa because it says the education official further revealed that the attacker later confessed to him that he had bought the knife to commit suicide mm -hmm. due to frustrations he experienced at home mm -hmm. during the long closure of learning institutions mm -hmm. okay sasa hapo what do you think is going on I think uh what cooling an anamimi, what to it wako wako somehow wako na stress. Mm -hmm. Depending na villa meka home. One was a ziwa wa jakua karibu na watoto. Mm -hmm. Mujwa mtoto akiwa shule, mzazi ya na forget about mtoto. So the same thing wame wamekuwa kifanya mto ya kiwa home. Mm -hmm. Unapata mzazi ya kienda subui, mm -hmm. anenda subui ka mama melala. Jioni ya narudi kama mtoto wa melala. Mm -hmm. So ha ata ata fuatili kujua mtoi wake the rest of the day amekuwa kifanya nini unaona mm -hmm. awana ile ile relationship between uh, mother and child mm -hmm. kujua tuna tunaita na ile ile relationship yao it is not that uh, tight mm -hmm. so the parent doesn't know what the kid do, does at the end, at the at the at the all the all of the day mm -hmm. so yeye yeah, yeah, ana akikuja mtu yeye ame, amelala so hawana hiyo time ya kuongea, hawana time ya kubond. Mm -hmm. So unapata mtu hii 
Mo, most of the children wao wanatumia drugs mm -hmm. juu ya peer pressure. Mm -hmm. Nona. Mm -hmm. So and then another thing hiyo story ya mtoto I think fault pia iko kwa shule. Mhm. Mm Mufikia mtoto akienda shule lazima asachiwe mm -hmm. aonekane nini amebeba. Mm -hmm. So that means labda aku aku searchiwa. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And in the event, to say, me, for example, Sasa, when we come home, I think almost nine months. Mm. Still. So, mm. okay, come home, and perhaps, easy industries in Zimbabwe, Gongwasana, the, the hotel industry, mm. is a kukula kula. Just basically, a lot of things have been happening. Nakuna mm. mm, hawana kazi just because COVID nineteen came na vitu ilibidi zilifungwa. So, what happens when mzazi akuwa nyumba? na ni hadi watoto wako wote kule na watoto saa kwa nyumba hakuli shule mm. you know that would be an, an extra help but yeah, hakuli yeah. shule yeah. so kila mtu anamwangalia what happens sasa mzazi akianza kusema tunafanya kazi si wote kila mtu ashike hustle mrudi na kenye mnaweza rudi nayo mm. are we going to blame parents somehow why sababu at the end of the day it's the responsibility of the parent to make sure that ule mtoto wako sawa mm -hmm. unapata mm -hmm. utaniambia utapatia mtoto wa 10 years aende ya work mm -hmm. at the end of the day atajipata ata na commit crime mm -hmm. so i work with the girls mm -hmm. unapata hii time ya covid mm -hmm. kumekuwa na story mingi sana za wasichana mm -hmm. unapata mtu amekosa pads mm -hmm. sawa atadanganywa we have 14 to 15 years girls when you are pregnant na when you are na watoto sahi sababu mtu hakukuwa na pad mm -hmm. na mzazi hayezi afford pad mm -hmm. si atadanganywa mm -hmm. mm -hmm. i have sex at the end of the day ndio nikupe pesa ndio nikupatie pesa eh wendo ununue nini wendo ununue pads mm -hmm. aya some of the parents hawafanyi kazi permanent mm -hmm. so wakati covid iliingia sasa ni vibarua mm -hmm. For, nimekwambia at, at time mimi huko nafanya domestic work care mm -hmm. So unapata awa wazazi huwa wana, wanaenda kukaa kwa mao. Lakini mi labda niko na mtu ananipigia ngazi mwana niambia kujo nifanyie kazi leo na kesho na kesho kutwa. But sasa kuna ule hana mm -hmm. anaenda kukaa kwa mao. The whole day ajapata kibarua. Mm -hmm. Amerudi kwa nyumba. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ile frustration na nini. Mwa mtoto ameshinda njaa the whole day. Mm -hmm. Una expect afanye nini. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Alafu pesa kwa saidi ya walimu. Maja, they also have people who have, they have, they have families. Mm. They maybe yako na mtoto pe, yako na mm. baby. Mm. And now they're angry because now teachers should be protected. And you know, yes. I can't fault you. It's true, they should be protected. Mm. So that's fine, ini. Ju kila mtu amejam. Kila mm. mtu wapa kwa historia amejam. Wazazi wame jam. Student amejam. Familia of the teachers wame jam. Like, mm. how, how do we fix this? Wo unaona aje? Me, me, I think, oh, uh, Sisi kama watu wazima, we have to control ourselves. Mm -hmm. Nona. Na pia watoto wetu vile wamerudi shule, mm -hmm. mi nikona teenager. Mm -hmm. She's 17, ako form 3. Kweni mtuwa mtu? Aya. Nikona teenager. Tanipea recipe, mbao unakaa hivi vizuri ya. Wow. <laughs> Ni vile nilimpara kitambo, 50 at 15. Wow. Yeah. So tunatoshana, ntakonyesha picha, tukimaliza show. Wow. Yeah. So, ako 17. Mm -hmm. Mimi na mtui wangu, I, si mchukuli yangi kama my daughter. Mm -hmm. I, I take her as my friend, my sister. Oh. So, tuko very, very close. Mm -hmm. Hakuna kitu tuwezi ongea. Mm -hmm. So, most, the, most of the time, mi utafta time. Na ongea na ule mtoto, sh, ni mtoto mstana. Mm -hmm. She is very delicate. Mwajwa mtoto mstana kuslide ni one time. Mm -hmm. So, the more tunongea, ya ukatiwa obvious. She's 17. Kana kawa wewe si ni mrembo basi. <laughs> ni mrembo. So mtu anaona ni msichana mkubwa. But anakuja ananiambia mam. Wewe unafikiri aje hii story? Unaona? Tunaongea. Mm -hmm. So nilikuwa nafikiria hizi shule si ziko na maybe ziko na counselors. Mm -hmm. Wanafanyia watoto PSA sama so, social cycle support. Mm -hmm. Wawapatie leso. Hata kama ni wana wa ade, wana wa. You never know inaweza change life ya mtu sana. Mm. -hmm. mm. Yeah kufungwa tu roho basically mm. we should just talk about the things zenye Africa tutazoea kuongelea eh mhm eh women is too alone eh <laughs> wadona una una alone na what <laughs> look at her eh okay <laughs> all right let's talk about this mm. um skill set situation mm -hmm. what are the skills that you teach what's your target audience ni boy child peke yake ni girl child ama umechanganya kimashakura both mm -hmm. 
both na 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 fundisha both uh, boy child na girl child wako empowered mm -hmm. so this unafanya detergent making mm -hmm. yogurt making mat making mm -hmm. na bead making mm -hmm. so ni ile mtu comf ako comfortable nayo mm -hmm. tunaweza fanya kuna kitu in, kama school fees hivi mm -mm. oh free ulijitolea tu mm -hmm. how is this benefiting you na kuanga passionate sana na community yangu Nimekupatia story at first nilipata mtu hii nikiwa 15 years. Nataka kuuliza but pia naogopa. <laughs> ah ah usikose kuuliza. Nilikuwa 15 by the way. Mm -hmm. So, uh, my first work ilikuwa domestic work. Mm -hmm. Niliandika ngo Nairobi West mm -hmm. for 1500 shillings. Mm -hmm. Nilikuwa mdogo so niko niko ile stage ya adolescence unajua unasumbua lakini unajua unasumbua kwa nini. So nikaenda nikaandikwa nikapitia through a lot as in mwenye nyumba anataka kunirep unaona hey you just got deep what <laughs> yeah for nilipitia nili uh, attemptiwa kurepiwa kure three times oh god so uh, ule mama alikuwa amenipeleka ngoko mimi nikajitoa so my mom hakuwa anajua mahali niko at that time mhm mm nilikuwa nimetoroka home uko na ball tema ushaza niko na ball hata iko na mwezi Nile unajuko ile adolescent stage unasumbua. Zina kuwasha washa. Tu. Zina kuwasha washa unasikia tu kuenda unajua. Uh -huh. So nimetoroka home nimeenda nikafanya kazi. Uh -huh. So miu kwa passion it sana na, na whatever I learn. Uh -huh. Miu give back to the community. Uh -huh. mm. So okay. I, this attempted rape three times. Uh -huh. Ilikuwa the same nyumba ama ulikuwa unatoka unaenda kujini. No nilikuwa na andikuwa different houses. So the first one bila nili niliona na repiwa nikatoka mimi nikaenda nikaambia oh mama wewe utanjua vile utapata unipatie pesa yangu. Mm. The next how sikumaliza hata 2 weeks. Mm. Yeah. So I mimi niko na hapana acha nirudi home. I had to go back home. Okay. Now mm. that we on this story jana acha mm. nikupe story jana nilikuwa nasikiza radio. Mm. So nilikuwa nasikia it was I think a Christian Nini, sijui nilijipata hapo aje, but yeah. nikapata story, so na mini kaka hapo. So ilikuwa some Christian type of station, mm -hmm. alafu walikuwa na ongelea house manager sasa. Mm -hmm. So, moja, I think either swali ilikuwa, how long have you been a house manager or how has the experience been? Ah, alafu kadem kingine kakapiga simu, kaa likuwa kamejao. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ati, <laughs> ah! I have been a house manager today for how many years and I don't understand. Mbona watu nasema wakisema ati tunanyemelewa? Ati o, unanyemelewa, unanyemelewa aje na umenda kwa mtu wa mne. Eh, sis, why are you upset? Ah, ah, iyo kitu yu ni asha. Sujui, because her, she says, she's very professional. So unenda kwa nyumba, alafu usia ati unenda kupigadeki style zingine haziko, apu unachora, sujui nini apu mbele ya mwanume ya wenyewe na na watch TV. So anapena apu advice, I'm like, ala? Kumbe, it's a whole thing. Mm. I'm like, yeah, na pia uwezi vava, sujui aje, nguwezi mekubana, sujui mbele yake, wanze kutembea, tembea aje. <laughs> Awa, natafuta. Wow, mm. sisi ya tuduwa tufu. She went on, she mm. went on and on. And then here you are telling me, you're very innocent, na nakujia by force. Mm. Na hakuna kutumeka. So, mm. for now, wata ni kuambia kwa saai. Mm -hmm. Saai kuna some organizations zenyu zimekuwa ziki train uh, girls, professional, housekeeping. Mm -hmm. Unaona? That time, so ulikuwa unachukuliwa anywhere unaenda unapewa kazi. Hiyo mm. time unaandika hata mtoto. Sasa huwezi andika mtoto. Mm -hmm. Unaona? Mm -hmm. So time vitu huenda zikichange. Mm -hmm. Kwa saa hii mimi huwezi nifanyia kitu obviously. Mm -hmm. Cuz already najua rights zangu. Mm -hmm. Unaona? Nime najua all about housekeeping. So niko hapo ku work. Mm -hmm. But that time at 15 unajua nini? Do you know anything? Hauko empowered enough? Ata brain hija develop ata vizuri. Enyewe ujagro ata. No, it is biological. I'm not making things up. Kuna mali, huwa kana grow, grow inside nandani. So, ata ujagro vizuri, haujijui vizuri, hawezi make decision. Unuona? Ma, how was it raising a child at 15, 16? How was that? It, guy, ata sitakangi kukumbuka. It was very hard. Mm -hmm. Fifteen, I was in form one. Mm -hmm. I went back to school after ten good years. 
Okay, but I'm glad you went back. Yeah, mm -hmm. I, I had to. Sababu uwezi pata kazi bila paper. Bila paper. Mm -hmm. So, but it was hard sababu sijui kufanya kazi. Mm -hmm. No, na we ni mdogo. Mtu wana kuangali hivya na sema, ai, una ya natafuta kazi ya, ya kazi gani. Mm -hmm. So, mi nilikuwa na menta mwana ume. Mm -hmm. Yeye ndo ali, ali, ali niingiza kwa hizi stories za organizations. Mm -hmm. For those 10 years, sikuwa nimekaa buri. Mm -hmm. I was trained to be education for two years, guidance and counseling for two years. Mm -hmm. So nilikuwa nafanya short, short courses mm -hmm. before niende tanani, nifanya, nirudi shule, nifanya, nifanya KCAC. Come on, you grew up very fast. Yeah, yeah. Life will be from 15 life to almost by 30. The way, <laughs> <laughs> sometimes na ambia nga mtu eji yangu anashtuka and, that, and then anona mtu yuangu anashindwa. For real. Ata mine za katas. Jamona bado but nona ni kukata. Utamona. Mm. Ata ni mbigi kukuliko. <laughs> Ana watch ti msalimie. Hi. Ako shule. Oh ah, yeah, by the way. <laughs> Wako ni rudi shule. Woy. Ako shule. But I'm glad she's in school. Mm. I, ushe, mwambi, sorry, I've interrupted you sama. Ah uh ah, -uh, it's okay. Ushai muambia story zako venye ulimlea ulimza. Siwezi kwa sa kumuambia. <laughs> Siwezi kwa sa kumuambia. Hata ya najua, I've suffered with her. Before, nifike maali niko, mm -hmm. tumesafa. Mm -hmm. Anajua. So, mi, mi, mi napenda kutumia, kutumia life experience yangu mm -hmm. kumuelezea on a life in another perspective. So, si huwa si hide anything. Mm -hmm. mm -mm. Mm. Wow. Mi hata tuneza kwa tuna watch vipindi hapo. Unajua squeeze media. Inaleta vipindi zingine mchana unashtuka sana. Maze! Anzikona. <laughs> Kizo zenye unajifanya. Very fast. Unena kwa simu. Mm. So sami sijifanya angi. Ah. Mm -mm. Ah ah. Hadi unakomen. Na muambia to discuss. Ah, Unaona yeah. ni nini neendelea hapo. Oh. Sababu at the end of the day. Wata ni kupe story. Mm -hmm. Kuna time nilikuwa nafanya... Um, Nilikuwa nafanya, ni, ni tulikuwa tu tunongea informal conversation na watoto 13 to 17 years. Mm -hmm. So tumeka hapo mtu yu, tuvijana sasa nilikuwa nongea na tuvijana. Di uno mtu tuwa 13 years ya kona girlfriend. Na, na mpeleka kwa ile nyumba ya mama yake. Sababu mama yake hako kazi. Hajui watoto, wa, wa, mtoto kama na akona girlfriend. So, misi tuna have conversation tu. mm -hmm. So ye, wow, wana, wako open wana niambia. Mi niko na dem. Na saisi yezi ya muka niende niambia dem yangu. Ati tuachane. Kwa nini tuachane? Do you imagine kuna mtorombaka anakuja kunitisha kondom 15 years. Namuliza kondom unapeleka wapi. Okay. Okay. So awa toto kitu nasema ni was, usiwa hide anything. Mm -hmm. They know. And they are doing. Mm. Sisi tunasema nga parents are the most important teachers kwa watoto wao. Mm -hmm. Unona. If you don't teach them about sexuality and sex. Watajulia uko? Kwa ni mini lifundishwa na mama yangu? <laughs> Nilijulia uko inje. So, watajulia uko inje. Mm -hmm. So, it's better waisikia wa kutoka kwako. Then mtu, akitaka kupotea, atapotea juu, anataka kupotea. Atapotea semange, si kuambiwa. Mamangu alinifita. Mamangu waku niambia. Ange niambia labda singe kuwa hapo malini. Kwa unajua. So muambie. Ata feel shy at first. Lakini as time goes on. Utoonanga anakuja. Sometimes hawa watoto ni wafani. Mm -hmm. Ani haza kuja na story ya. Beshte yangu alipitia ina ina. Tumbe na in real sense ni yeye. Mm -hmm. Unona. So as time goes by. Ata kuwa open na wewe. Na ata kuwa na kuambia everything. That goes on with her. Ama with him. I have so much more respect for you. So mm. it's not just about skill set. Ni kuongea pia. Kuong, by the way, kuongea ni very, very important. Mm -hmm. Mi nimezuia some girls kufanya abortion. Mm -hmm. Through life experience ya. Mm -hmm. Au ni wakubwa mtu wako, wako labda wako 19, 18, 20. Unapata? Mm. Then anataka kufanya abortion juu wako ready kupata uo mtoto. Mm -hmm. Mi na hapo, Sex education squeeze in another class for Sindio. Hakuna kitu wa ujui. At 20, kuna kitu ujui. Hakuna kitu ujui. So, ukienda ku have sex, uluku onajua, obviously, 
ni either nipate HIV nipate STI ama nipate yeah. ball mm -hmm. so uki ukikuja kuniambia hauko prepared kupata mtoto ndio hauko prepared maybe depending na age mm -hmm. lakini at the end of the day imeingia sasa kutoa itakusaidia na nini Mm -mm. Let's say for example because there's once we had a talk about suicide. Mm. Alafu tukashtukia kuna mtu aliyetuambia kwa social media zetu that actually alikuwa anafikiria but sasa jo tumeongea kwa TV alienda kaongelesha mtu. Mm. So what if maybe kuna dem sai ako your age maybe 20 and below na nafikiria kitu kama hiyo unaweza mwambia nini? Mimi naweza mwambia sijaribu kutoa. Ju mtoto ni baraka kitu ya kwanza. Ale, kwa ni misi nili struggle nikiwa 15 hadi saa hii. Mtu wangu wako form 3 na struggle peke yangu. Ama single mom. Mtu second born ako 14 years. Ah, ako 2 years. Na nilimpata because I was ready kupata oh. mtu hii. Unapata. Mm -hmm. So unajua what entail, it entails kulea mtoto. Unapata. Mm -hmm. So asitoe ball. Mm -hmm. Azai. Ayezi mzui ya kuachieve dreams zake. Aneza late kuachieve. But at the end of the day, akitaka kuachieve, ata achieve. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Nasikia ni kuvisit sometime ata mimi. Karibu. Nidikage tu ni msikia ya kiongea. <laughs> Neza taka so ukamu so sana kwa sessions ah, yeah. yangu. Aki. Taku Ta invite, sindio? Mm -hmm. Minta kujo. So. Okay, sorry. Sasa tumeingia story ni kidogo nimejisa. How? Alright, let's, <laughs> let's get back to strength of a woman. Alright, mm -hmm. so you're a facilitator. You are as you, you know, teach skill sets and all these things. What else do you do? You're a hairdresser. Uh -huh. Yeah. Ingine. Basically, that is what I do. Now, why, why, what did the community ever do for you that you feel like you want to give it back to them? Why do you have so much passion to help other people? I have so much passion, Sababia. Whatever I went through. Mm -hmm. uh, Police idea. Yeah, someone mm -hmm. helped me to be where I am today. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Since mm -hmm. I had a male, male mentor. mentor. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He was the one who uh, introduced me to several organizations that empowered me. So, me seem selfish. Mm -hmm. Whatever I learn, I mm -hmm. want to give it back. Because Nikona Mdem, Mstana, Mstana Wangu Nipatia strength. Sana, sana, sana. Because, mm -hmm. you know, kaa juzi ya kianda shule nili muambia, at least, uko 17. Mi nilikuza ni kiwa 15, at least umeongeza 2 years. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, na muambia, aki mamu, shikilia tu yomu waka. <laughs> ufike 18. Shikilia tu yomu waka, ufike 18. <laughs> at least, ni kue nasema ngenyewe. Nililea mtoto wakafika a certain place. Na alimaliza shule. Na alimaliza shule. Uh -huh. Au dakuwa na complications za life ati umesomo, umestop shule, ume, umekaa tena home, umeenda tena. So yo maindi yako inafikiria kutafuta pesa uko shule. Mm. No, no. Mm -hmm. So at least ni kwa na, na mchekesha na mambi, hey mam, congratulations. At least umeongeza two years. <laughs> <laughs> She's so cool, Aki. <laughs> So, shikilia tu, uongeze, umalize tu yu form 4. Then, tutongia the next, the next thing. Na muliza mamu, unatakanga kunifanya nini? Ya maniambia mamu, miya kiki tunatakanga kufanya, ni kukubaya hao. Yo niambia nataka kunibaya nyumba. So, na muambia, na do you think utanibaya uta, uta nyumba? Kama ukona tu boyfriends, utu tu boyfriends. Masomo na boyfriend as yezi ingiana. So ni either masomo ama boyfriend. We chagua moja. Nikiwa shule, nikuwa nambiwa hivyo nachoka. <laughs> nikuwa nachoka. Nikuwa shangasa we na daddy mlimitu wapi. Kwa kona. <laughs> yani wewe moja ni pige isa. Mungina ka pige isa. Nikuwa 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 nikuwa. But unajua life ya kitambu ilikuwa tofauti. Mm -hmm. Ni rea sana ungepata mtu wanazalia kwao. Mm -hmm. mm. Unlikuwa unazalia kwa buwanako. Mm -hmm. Ukizalia kwenye yu ni tabu. Mm -hmm. Sababu unajua wazo, kitambo, me, my mom used to tell me that kitambo, boy, boy child alikuwa naongelesha angwa na babu, mm -hmm. then girl child anongelesha na shosho. Mm -hmm. So wanakuwa wakijua, wakijua vitu, do's and don'ts. Mm -hmm. Unona? But sai, sisi wote tumekua working class. Oh. Atuna time na wato? Oh. 
watoto yeah. so wao wanalan vitu kwa ground kwa ground uh, yeah. na vitu kwa ground ni di different <laughs> can we <laughs> buy her tea guys what to talk by so ni different mm -hmm. so mtoto wako akilan vitu huko nje ina wacha wacha skip kutoka kwako mimi life experience siko sangi kuambia mtu wangu mm -hmm. na mwambie out of hizo stories zote ushaisikia ukikata hivi ukiongelesha watu ni, ni gani ishai kustua we mwenyewe hadi kwa eh okay all right kwa hii miaka na uko na mashida zinaka hivi unaweza share yeah there is this time uh, kuna mdem hata alinicall tu akukuja but alinicall akaniambia baba yake mzazi baba yake mzazi has been attempting to rape ha Juma make huwa anafanya kazi anafanya kazi kikuyu so wameachwa na babake and babake ni yule mlevi sana so akaniambia babake huwa na attempt kum rape naweza msaidia aje mm -hmm. so that night akanikola akaniambia babake ni mlevi sana na anamsumbua mm -hmm. so i had to go ni mbali kidogo na kwangu but nilienda sana ya usiku mm -hmm. nikaenda nikapata huo Mbaba nikamuliza ni nini anajaribu kufanya kwa huyo msichana. But sasa he was so rude. So nikamwambia for today wacha nichukue mtoto niende nilale na yeye kwangu. Then kesho asubuhi tutafanya nini? Tutaongea. Mm -hmm. Then the next day mtoisi akaenda shule. Mm -hmm. I had to go nikaenda nikaongea na baba mtoto. Ya akaniambia juu ni nini na muingililianga. Aya eh anakunywa pombe anakunywa pombe then anatan kuwa violent. So anapata ameshika mtoto wake. Mm -hmm. So nikamuliza ushai attempt kum rape akasema hapana. Huwa akienda kum rape anatoroka. So ikabidi nimchukue ni nimtafutie counselor amfanyie PSS. Then squeeze he's the best dad. Hata yeye ni call ananiambia ulinisaidia a lot so uh, as in ukikuwa uki mtu wa community hata sometime back nilikuwa naambia some of my girls nasikia kutoka south bini and the place nyingine so ananiuliza ai na watu wamekuzoea sasa itakuwa aje cuz unajua mtu akiwa na problem kwangu ni hapo tu mimi naishi ghetto so ni ni easy kuni access so unaweza kuja tukuje sorry so mtu ana imagine hata saa ngapi anaweza kuja so nikitoka what happens okay me bado ni kwa history nyingine mm -hmm. na lord there, there are about 5 million ways history ngeisha mm -hmm. ngapi ita police ashikwe mm -hmm. ungeambia mamake akuje achukue mtoto mm -hmm. yo story ishe mm -hmm. <laughs> Yani ungemwitia watu wamfunze because mm. how are you being violent or attempting to rape your own child okay but you chose instead love and understanding ulisema mm. tu ngoja kwanza utulie ziishe zishuke alafu ndo tutaongea alafu you took it further ukampeleka hadi kwa counselor wewe mali unaenda mbinguni uniachie space uambie Mungu please unajua sometimes unaangalia unaona huyu mtu ataenda ashikwe si ndio Si ndio? Hmm. Akaendani. Ndio anafanya vitu. Si unaona yeye aliniambia aji aku anajielewa. Mm -hmm. Unaona? Sab labda ako, I, ali, obviously alikuwa under influence of drugs, mm -hmm. ndio? Hakuwa anajielewa. Ataenda atoke ndani. Najua ile makali ya mtoto wangu alifanya ni ingie ndani labda vile atajitetea mm -hmm. atatoka. Ile makali ya mtoto wangu amenituma ndani. Akirudi, anarudi akiwa aje double twice hasira double twice Ooh. so instead ya unaangalia anga unaona situation vile iko unaona unaamua yeah, the next day alikuwa anaongea politely alikuwa violent maka ananitusi kwa nini unanichukua mtoto wako wewe ndo una mtoto wangu wewe ndo umemza unamlipianga school fees wakati sijui alikuwa amelazwa hosi ulikuja ulikuja kumtolea do unaona vitu kama hizo so he was telling me that so nikakaa nikaona ai hapa kuna shida so unajua mimi usema tafuta root root cause ya ile problem mm. aliko then utajua ku deal nayo if it's a police case with well and good yeah mm.
If it's something you can sort out, sort out. Mm -hmm. is, is anyone else mesmerized by her right now? Come on, Mimi. Like, eh, <laughs> to some vote president. Ah. Because I, for real though. Mimi na politics to Koivi, my friend. Ah. And the Kwevi. best people are usually our penangi politics. So I don't like politics. Yo, yo, nini, uh -uh. Ah, ah. Mm. Ah, we, tumtafte kitu. Can we just arrange, guys? No. <laughs> what? Eh. So, we go through a lot. Through a lot. Ah. Unaza itu wata sanani ya usiku. Depending on Mbono what's happening. Okay, I imagine si raisi kuwa single parent. Because my mom at some point was a single parent. Mm. Na sisi tukua tatu. Na ukona tutu wawili. Uchoki? Masema, ay, leo nimekula stress yangu. Eh, I've just provided for my family and I think nime, nime choka na stress. Ya leo tu wacha tutunlale ni pumzike tuonge kesho. Mm -mm. Unakuwa sa aje kutoka. Hawezi choka, my friend. Aji. If you, uh, kama ukona, ukona passion ya community, na you have community at heart, wezi choka. Hawe, mbaka, un, mi ujisahau. Do you know sometimes unajisahau? Mm. Unashindwa kwani mimi, sijikumbu kangi. As in, uko, 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 uko kwa shida za watu sana mbaka we mwenye unajisahau. <laughs> Na funny enough watu kama we, u, mimi sa ile mtu wako kwa shida, hakuna mtu wana kusaidia. That was my next question. <laughs> Nani kusaidia wewe? Hakuna mtu wana kusaidia, but nikona, nikona friends. Some few friends neza. If anything happens, neza pigia simu ni muambie. Iko hivi na hivi na hivi. Nona? Natuwa nguvu wapi? Sijui ni God. Mm. Ni God tu. Mm -mm. Ni God. Mm. I don't know what to do, guys. I, 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 I wish I could give her something to say thank you. I wish, I wish. Nah, Aki. it's okay. Ah. This story is strong, Aki. Mm. But anyway, you can still find us at White Five on Facebook, White Five Four channel on Twitter. Hashtag is White in the Morning. We are currently in the middle of a very, very phenomenal interview with a phenomenal person. Napa menistua yani, I think di kona goosebumps za jabidi. Jabidi ni kona goosebumps. Whoa. All right, so, kama kuna mtu wapo nje na atuka, is it lazima toke hudienu ama neza toka no. anywhere ndo wakuja no. participate and how can they do that if they wanted to? Um, na kuanga sometimes na sessions on weekends. So, kama aneza taka kukuja, aneza nitafuta. Eh. Mm -hmm. Aji, tutafta wapi? Sina social media. Tuambia wapi. <laughs> He, ina maluza. So, uh, niko na jina ngumu. <laughs> Sema tu. So, Facebook, Instagram, mm, WhatsApp, eh, Twitter, ni Joy, Fire Mama Mwix. Mm -hmm. Ebu, let me try and spell Fire Mama. Guys, I know Shule ndo zimefunguliwa. <laughs> so, nukwa na karatasi ya family. <laughs> Tusiaribu gazeti. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Ndiyo yu nyuma. Unaona hadi x-ray Talet zake ni pigi Okay Fire Fire as in moto F-I-R-E Fire moto Alafu M-O Then M-O Double M Good girl Unaka ya pedi chocha Sani mengi ya tu Alright So one more time Joy Fire moma Mwix Mesikia Joy Fire moma Mwix We Uya naenda mbinguni Tuende na yeye Please Eni ombe ini we, 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 we. Wow, okay. So, what I'll call me, I'm too cabled to Malaysia. My last words, Evie. Kilam. Me na taka call me. Kilam too many ana ni watch. Na na shukuru sana for your support. When I do it, it has not been easy. To me struggle a lot. After anyway, and partners come on as a jitokeza, the better. To support our stand. To support our vision. Because mm. usema, when you empower a person, you empower the whole community. Mm -hmm. Depending na mm -hmm. it all starts with you. Mm. If you if if you get empowered, please empower someone else. Um to atam kanga nasema. Someone somewhere help me. So no na pia me na semanga someone somewhere help me. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm -mm. Ebu fanya hivi nywele kwanza wa onembora ndikuwa na salesi. Because look at that! Woo! 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 Eh, eh. 
My favorite thing about Kenya Pesama, that's funny, empower a person. Mm. For, I've been hearing complaints due to my empower girl child, son, a boy child, a match on you. So empower everybody, okay? Empower boy child, empower girl child. I love for Pia, when I join us, I'm going to struggle, like in Surya, I'm going to struggle. I wish kunge kwa na mali tu tunge pip tu ane okay and yeah I'm a struggle but say na cafe thank you you like in a shine too everywhere she has a wonderful smile and I'm dogo I told you someone I'm too I'm too but we believe you we, we really believe you fifteen mm -hmm. eh well, fifteen ikitambo you tell me at fifteen eh I had to go through a lot but thank God I'm here mm. Mm. if you hadn't the I want to leave a a legacy in my community. Hey, you know, I'm going to give. Mm -hmm. Ule, I'm going to give. I'm going to give. I'm going to At least, that I'm going Sita kuwa mali natakanga kukua. Someone else ni mtuwe from hapa. Kidogo, tu hata sema ingi sana. Hata kama ni an inch. Mm. Mm. My heart is about to burst. <laughs> so before it bursts open, guys, we're going to take a short break. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I try to follow Facebook, white five four channel on Twitter. Hashtag is white in the morning. We send it because we have a conversation. In fact, funny enough, or coincidentally, to know on our socials, how you feel about venyo atoi wa squeeze wa na reziwa. How you feeling about that? Yeah, let us know. Are we pointing fingers, naming names? Are we playing the blame game? We're going to find out, but don't go away. <laughs>